Bea, congratulations! Thank you! Thank you for me, Diane! Top 5! How did it feel? Well, um, when they were calling all of the countries, well, it was always exhilarating. Uh, just um, waiting for Philippines to be called. <laughs> Yeah, were you nervous? And sobrang Ah, uh, surprisingly hindi po. Usually I feel nervous like um even even during rehearsals, uh, kinakabahan ako. Pero kanina parang uh, kasi it was the last time that we will be up on that stage and makakasama na ko yung mga delegates. I was just really enjoying the moment and uh doing my best. So uh, I gave you all the experience ko kanina, and I'm just really happy with the results. Uh, seven won the week was top 10, and then I was last the top 5. Were you nervous waiting or you were confident na makakapasok ka? I was quite confident ko na makakapasok po tayo. Yeah, top 5, super good. I mean, wow, you really made us proud. Overall, um, how are you feeling right now? Well, I'm just really happy that I was able to, to deliver um, uh, a really good performance for the Filipino people, especially that uh, majority of the audience are Filipinos. Of course, I wanted to, to show them uh, what we are capable of and really just do my best. So. Uh, I'm very satisfied with everything that I did and uh, no regrets. Uh, alam kong nga uh, nabigay ko lahat. So, walang ano, walang, walang mga doubt. And I'm really happy, I'm really happy that we were able to, to reach the top five. Okay, so in the top five, there was the the Q and A. How did you feel? Well, uh, I was um, paano ko ba? Ah, then ini enjoy ko lang po yung tanong at the same time kinabahan po ako kasi uh, I didn't expect lang na naganon yung mga questions na parang uh, I thought it was more about our personality mm. and. Yun lang. I'm actually contented with my answer. I'm satisfied naman with how everything uh, went well. Yeah. Yes. You look super good in the Francis Libiran gown. Wow. Ikaw daw yung pumili? Ikaw yung pumili ng gown? You chose to wear that gown out of the four that you brought to Israel? Yes. Um... I always said, because even before, um, during the Miss Universe Philippines competition, I always wanted to wear a gold gown. Mm -hmm. Pero, uh, yung mga designs ni Mama Fern, for me, was uh, in gold colors, yung blue and red. So when I saw that um, Sir Francis made a gold gown, parang na-excite ko ako, and uh, kaya ko siya pinili, kasi parang dream come true to be wearing a gold gown on stage. So na you you did your fierce look in the first part of your walk. I noticed. I did. And then I, did. <laughs> I remember. I remember. I mga comments that I remembered. Yeah. Ika, ikaw yung pinakamaraming ano cheer dun sa venue. You were the most yes. popular candidate. and daming Filipino. Na surprise nga po kahit si Steve Harvey na daming Filipino sa audience para daw hindi Israel yung pinuntahan natin. Pero, I'm really happy for uh, and and grateful for the support. Uh, yung iba galing pa sa ibang bansa, lumipad lang talaga dito para manood ng Miss Universe. And despite the the uh, uh, the situation of COVID here in Israel, marami pa rin nakarating. So, grateful talaga ako sa lahat ng support ng mga Pilipino. Yeah. Si Miss India, uh, she's one of uh, our our roommate, and uh, we all, we all knew na sa sa po talaga yung mananalo. We were all rooting for her, kasi nga uh, she works really hard, and uh, there are even times na sobrang pressure niya na hindi niyo naman 
siya. So we're very happy for her. We know what she's capable of and uh, we're very happy with the result. We're proud of her. So what's next, Bea? When are you, uh, what are your activities for the day? And what are you doing tomorrow? So uh, it's just 7 a.m. here. Kakabalik lang namin sa, uh, sa hotel galing sa venue. So una namin ginawa is kumain kami ng breakfast kasi hindi maayos yung dinner namin last night because of the preparations and we were anxious also kaya hindi na namin nagawa yung uh, kumain ng marami. So bumawi kami ngayon sa breakfast and then after breakfast we're gonna go pack our things because some of the girls will be going home na. Okay, what about you? Uh, the same thing po. I'm eating breakfast now and then after I'll go up, uh, take off my makeup, uh, sleep siguro for a while and then pack my things because I will be flying to Manila na tomorrow. Oh, you're flying to Manila tomorrow. And then pagdating mo dito, are you going to uh, stay to Cebu or you're going to stay a few days in Manila? Uh, I believe I have I have to be in quarantine pa po when I get there. So, yun mo na. And then I'll wait for my schedule uh, from the organization kung uh, my events for Christmas. I have no idea yet, pero I still have to wait. Oh, yung nga pala, I forgot about the quarantine. <laughs> Galing, what are you eating for breakfast? <laughs> well, I just have egg and um, ravioli. And tapos na kami kumain, so I can show my plate. Pero yun lang, uh, nothing is too heavy para makatulog. <laughs> okay, congrats, Bay. I hope to talk to you again and see you here in Manila. Super proud of you. Galing ng, galing ng performance mo.